Hey everybody, how's it going? Doctor Incompetent here, and let's play some Final Fantasy, shall we? Alright, well, I'm sitting here in Canaria, the city of dreams, and it's time to push this guy out of the way, and then check out what magic is available. So, for example, I have Cure and I have Harm, but do I want Fog or Ruse? Um, you know what? I want Fog. And then, do, let's see. I have, uh, with Tim, I've got Fire and Lightning. So what other first level black magic spell is there that I'm excited about? Sleep or Lock? Uh... I'll go with sleep. The reason I'm hoping that sleep attempts to cast on every single target, I, I don't recall. But I do believe that fog, for example, um, works on every single party member, but it might not. Um, I'm going to buy one tent. And now we're good to go. The tent... You can use it to rest outside to get your spells back. I think it saves the game, but it might not. I also don't recall if it actually gives you all of your health back. Like, maybe you have to have a cabin for that to happen. But anyway, we'll figure it out. So here's our amazing bridge, and now we're going to cross it. And venture into the great unknown. See, here is a port for our ship, and if you were curious, the ship, yes, can go underneath that bridge. And then you have two options. You can go um, over through the swamp, or you can go up and around, and I'm going to go through the swamp. Oof. Well, okay, so here's another thing we have to evaluate. Are we strong enough to just make it all the way to the, the boat city? Can't, the name is escaping me, or do we need to grind for a bit and get strong? So let's find that out. I'm going to do some experimenting while I'm here. I'm going to cast Fog. Okay, Fog is single target. That's that's a shame, but it is very, very nice. It's a very good spell um, in terms of dodging, but I think a heal will do more for us. So, I'm going to put everything into this Mad Pony and just try to take it down, and then I'm going to see if I can put anything to sleep. How about all of them? Good lord. Sleep just won the day. I mean, it, it cost them all a single turn. That is fantastic. All right, we're going to go ahead and double in here. Now, I won't use another spell again. It's too valuable, but what we were spared there was a great deal of heartache. And actually, maybe there's a chance that they don't wake up. I don't know. I'm just going to try to do it this way. Oof. Yeah, see, that's the thing about this game. You really can't guarantee where the hits go. I think the, the probability skews them towards the top, but, I mean, they just hit Tim and nearly took him down. Hmm, and my rough mathematics is doing really badly at actually killing anything. We're going to go ahead and cure Tim and pray that he doesn't die, and I'm going to put everything into these two. There we go. Oof. There we go. Alright. Yeah, so... I think the answer is pretty clear that... We need to uh, cut our teeth a little bit more before we make it all the way. Maybe get up to something like 5th level. It's not a question of gear at this point, because we have... I do believe all of the gear that we can get from the first town, it's just a matter of 
health. All right, so that was 63 experience. So if I go in and I look at Hunk, we need 223 to get to the next level. But, I mean, you can see that fight took a lot out of us. I have to rest. I have to use half the money I got from that fight at the end, but that's totally fine. This is how these games are. You need to get stronger or you're never going to make it. And we just have to be patient. And grind a bit. Honestly, with this party too, we're really, really strong. So we'll be fine in just a bit. One of the main things that will make us insane is getting some of the, like, Lightning 2 or some of the spells to hit the entire group of enemies. Then you can just let the experience rain down upon you. All right. I might very well want to build up a stockpile of gold just to buy uh, curing potions to supplement along the way so that we don't have to, I mean, go through all of our first level spells just healing up after a fight like that. But either way, that's a be much better place to fight. Like, across the bridge, the enemies get stronger. Alright, so we know this group. I think... Um, I'm going to see how much damage I can do with like a spell like fire here. Missing is terrifying. Alright, we did 40. That's very good. Alright, that crit um, is going to save us a lot of heartache. So, this should do it. Um, and it's... Man. If they're not hitting Hunk, they're just doing so much damage, it's uh, otherworldly. Jeez, that was a terrible round. The fact that these guys are hard to hit is not pleasant. Alright, yep. Okay, please hit Hunk. Oh my god. Oh my god, I can't kill one. There we go. We should be spared somebody getting killed here. Yeah, that, that seals it. The fact that he attacked Hunk is pretty much the end of it, so we should be okay. There we go. Oof. But it is 47 experience, and so we need, like, five more fights like that, and we'll be up a level. And that's good. Let's go ahead and... Um, Let's get people back up off the ground there. Alright, we should be okay. Let's kind of just experiment. Ooh, there's a little desert up there. Wow, an ogre. Alright, an ogre is a great amount of experience, but he hits like an absolute truck. So what we need to do is think about... Um, let's just fight, but we're definitely using our big guns on this guy. If we can kill him... Okay, luckily he missed. We stand to gain a lot. Mm, I didn't really do that much. That's sad. Alright, let's try lightning then. Yeah, 25 damage. Not pretty. Okay, so lightning is better against the ogre. But we're out of spells anyway. So, let's just kind of feel this out. See if we can win. Ouch. Alright, 
right, good. Please attack Hunk. Okay, good. We got it. Now, let's see what we get for one ogre. Look at that. See, that's the key from the ogre. 195 gold. That is disgustingly good. All right, so we need to go back and rest immediately. And we're going to just go ahead and use the rest of our spells to... Well, we're not in emergency status unless we encounter, like, an ogre or something. But um, we should be good. And yeah, once we make it over the bridge, we're 100% safe. I don't think there's a enemy configuration that can beat us around the initial castle. It's these enemies are so easy that we're we're totally okay. Alright, let's get him down like this. Even Steven split of our group's resources. No problem, just fighting in the forest. Just taking down some imps. Hey, that 24 gold plays, pays for our uh, little hotel spree here. All right. Now, let me check our status. See how close we are. 116. All right, so... Depending on what we get, probably about three strong fights, and we will level up. I'm going to go ahead and buy... Um, one... Two... Three... Four, five. Let's just buy as many heals as we can and be happy about it. I'm not going to push for the next town until I get one more level. But heal potions are just an investment that's always worth it. Alright, this is a big fight. We know this fight. So let's be careful, and what we're going to do is, I think it's the right play to sleep, or at least try to. Alright, so we got three of the four, really good. And the only one that we didn't sleep, ooh, yes, Doc hit for 30 right there, that was tremendous. All right, and then I am going to just use um, fire on this guy. All right, so he... We saved ourselves so much damage right there. With that sleep spell. Oof. All right. I hate to do this, but I'm just putting everything... I'm, I need to kill that one. I have to make sure that that one dies. Jeez. Look at this. They're just running roughshod over us. Okay, phew. We killed one. Alright. Everybody kill this one right now. It's getting scary. Alright. So, we can do this. And then we have to cure Chop. This mad pony has not been touched. So we just have to pray that it attacks Hunk. It did. And all is right with the world. Now from here on out, we should be fine. It's a fairly light heal. 21. Alright, attacking Hunk is great. If everybody hits, we should be okay. 35 is very, very strong. There we go. All right, so what do we get here? This is 60, right? So now it's just like, maybe we could do it in one fight. Let me just check the status. It's a little scary to have our black mage with 29 health, but let's see what happens. 
Oh, okay. Interesting. This is a perfect place for fire. Oof, they went right after Tim, too. Look at that. Fire just wrecks these guys. Alright, so let's try then... And see if we can put down the bottom one with Hunk. Oof. That's so scary. Oh my god. There you go. Alright. We're going all in. I need something. I need a miracle. Oh. We didn't get the miracle. We just got Chop getting beat up. This is the thing about having a black belt early. They just take so much damage. However, um, in the long run, they will... I love them because they start getting so many attacks that they do insane damage and make up for their uh, light hit points. All right. Go ahead and cure here and then... Um, there. And that should be good. We have 110 gold. We need 22 experience. So I think one more fight on this other side should do it for us. Let's just see if we can get a fight on the plains here. It's been known to happen. Oh, okay. Well, these are a little bit too easy. Eh, but it, anyway, we can just go back to the castle now and just finish this off. Alright, let's take down an imp. Let's just go back to the town and get him a couple of fights here in our favorite forest, the Royal Hunting Ground. Hmm. Actually, this won't do it. This is too easy of a fight. But the cool thing is when you fight a fight like this, at least you know nothing's going to go wrong. Like, I could get greedy and go try to fight, but then what if I get... You know, four mad ponies again. I don't know if I have the steam, especially without being able to cast sleep, you know. And I don't want to spend 30 gold just resting to go out and fight one hard fight when I can just, in a few easy fights, actually make some money and then get the level. Mm, I don't even know if this will do it. I might need one more after this, but either way. Zero risk. Let's go, Imp. It's you and me. And by me, I mean a, fo a party of four warriors of light in your face. Alright, yep, one more fight, but no problem. I'm going to do the tight square right here. I love walking in this forest right by the edge. Chance to strike first as well. Oh, man. Let's make this something that the imps will remember. The imps of this forest will never forget this day of butchery. Oh, we missed. We had a chance there, Hunk. It didn't go like I wanted, but... We got it. Oh no! What are we, two away? Four away. Ugh. That's funny. Alright. Well. We'll get there. Yeah, here we go. This is a good one. This is the kind of fight you want all the time. 
So the pairing is Hunk and Tim and Chop and Doc. That should be the best distribution of damage. We just need Hunk to hit. Yeah, that's about right, isn't it? We had a couple of misses from the A-team there. Look at that. Ten damage from a wolf. Alright, here we go. Fourth level, everybody. Alright, now look at that. Hunk's over 100 hit points. Beautiful strength, agility, intelligence, luck. And then Chop is... Whoa, Chop surged on hit points. Almost got to 100. Strength, agility, intelligence, vitality. Doc is rolling in hit points, too. And ooh, Tim, not bad, man. 73? Great. Alright, well, um, perfect. And then let's rest. We now have two castings of a second level spell and that's another reason why we really, really want to make it to the next town is to get those second level spells we can also buy uh, better weapons and armor which is a huge deal all right okay and then so we will invest um, I'm gonna buy one pure and buy another heal. And then we're gone. Now let's look. Do we have four castings? Yeah, we now have four castings of level one spells, which is also a tremendous increase. All right. We're going. We're going for it. Warriors are light. We're surging. We're surging. Ooh, this is a interesting mix here. All right. So... This is not that bad. We can totally do this. Let's finish this. It's a lot of enemies on the screen at once, but most of these enemies are terrible. 13 damage is not what I wanted to see. But I can't complain with that first turn. Every single target was taken down in a hit, so... Oof. Stop hitting the back lines, will ya? It's not appreciated. There we go. Art. That was art. Um, okay. 72 gold is very welcome. Our cause needs the gold. Alright. So here's what you have to do now. You surge through the forest. And then... Alright. A single ogre. This should be okay. And we know that lightning is the one against this guy. The stream of lightning looks really sweet. Ooh, and he attacked Hunk. That's so great. Pretty good. Let's see if in one round of just attacking we can do this. I, I'm being very cautious with my MP. We don't do a lot of damage, though, unfortunately. Oh, we got it. Never mind, I was all nervous. No problem. Big cash reward, too. Ogres are so fun to take down. That much money? Oof. And it's an iguana, and he just rolled in and bopped me for 24. That's not nice, dude. Iguana. I mean, he, he looks like he's wearing eyeglasses and has a goatee. Because this... Is iguana the... I haven't seen an iguana like this in my time, but I'll take it. Whatever. Get him. Come on, somebody put him down. Oof. 12 damage to Hunk. That's actually insane. I might be completely underestimating this guy. Yeah. I should be using spells against him. I had no idea he had that much damage in him, but he's done just tons of damage to our group so far. Let's just give him fire. Wow, that did nothing, but it still killed him, so fair enough. Man, the payout for that is really poor, considering how much damage he did. But that's why we have magic. So, do this. That should be good enough for now. 
All right. I'm staying out of the trees, and there's the town right there. So we're going to go this way. And whoop, whoop, we made it. And what town is this? Hell. Oh, that's right. That's right. This town has been invaded by pirates. I have a mohawk, but I am not one of the pirates. Um, I'm pretty sure... Can you even... Oh, okay. You can go to the inn and stuff. Um, it's 50 gold. All right. I was not sure how I remembered this, but yes, they've been invaded by pirates, and I was like, oh, can you even go to the stores? Are they all closed? No, but here's a pirate, and you can fight him on your terms. Before we fight a pirate, I'd like to check out... Um, not the armor, but the weapons. You fight that guy, and you can get his boat, which is tremendous. But there's some other things I want first, like... There's the white magic shop. Let's see what second level black magic spells are available. Yeah, so we can get ice. Um... Slow, dark, and... I don't know what... Temper is. We'll have to figure that out, but... Um... Those are expensive. So let's go ahead and see if we can get Hunk a better weapon. Oof. We can't. But we need 550 for this. Honestly, this is probably better than what we have. So it's a, it's like a temporary improvement. I mean, look at, look at uh, Hunk. He's 20 damage. And if we go into weapon... Oh my god, that's what he already had. It just is wooden looking in the in the animation. I've I've wasted I've wasted the Warriors of Light cash reserves. I feel pretty bad about that. But now we have an idea of how much money we need. And we've made it to the second town. What spells are available for white magic for level two? Anti-lightning, invisible, mute, and lamp. Hmm. Boy, never mind. I completely overestimated second level spells. They're pretty trash. Not saying that they're worthless. They're just not what I was hoping for. So this is a town of upgrading our weapons and armor. And we will do that um, in the next episode. And we will farm around this town... It's 50 gold instead of 30 gold, but we don't have to walk all the way across, and we can stay close to the town and fight, and I think that's what we'll do. So, everyone, I want to thank you so much for tuning in for this episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy. We made it to town number two. We got some pirates to deal with, but we need to make a little cash first, level up a little bit, and we'll be there. All right, everybody, I hope you have a great evening or day, and I'll check you next time. Take care.